okay, and when you're on the console, Eric, could you tap that half hour meter and see if you can get uh, that lower one to come up some? I, I banged the uh, control panel uh, hard, Tony, and nothing, not, none of the meters changed. So. Oh, okay, okay, fine. What happened, huh? Uh, Tony, uh, a double core here too. Right, we'll need a double core. Hey, you, you cut out. Uh, yes, uh, we would like a double core. The rake saw high first priority, and then the double core. Okay. That LPM is the rest of the piece, isn't it? Get your eye all there. Huh? Oh, oh, I'm sure it is. Okay, the uh, Velcro on the side, the glue on the Velcro on the sun shield, or whatever it does, it's probably the same glue you used on the padded bags because they came loose too. Okay. Put that sun shield on there or you want to take it off and throw it away? Well, if it's doing any good at all, let's just leave it on. It doesn't seem to be in a picture. Yeah, we on a five-hour job now. Yeah. Uh, we on yeah, I'll put the best pressure on the way to go somewhere again. We're going a little bit over. Oh, yeah. I'll come get the I'll come get the door. Drop the door right where I wanted to. Make sure that close up. Sample. Okay, we got 30 minutes here at Station 10, Prime. Here we go. I had a big eyes looking the wrong way. Well, I just can't see anything when I get this camera much shadow. That's a good place, Jeremy. There's the down sun. A four F eight cross sun. How long is this stop, Tony? How long is this stop, Tony? Okay, this is a thirty minute stop. Okay. Home again, home again. Look at that, that, that right list. Is. So we got some glass coated uh, rags here, Tony. Okay. The rake. I don't see anything with Okay, that was about a half a bag full. One scoop. Bag full. Right. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yep. Okay, Tony, out of that scoop, we lost uh, the uh, two biggest rocks. I poured too fast. Bag fast enough, Charlie. Stop and this gravity field. Let's get moving. Okay, there we go. Sure. Oh, bags for a second. Yeah. I got bags on my camera here with me. Dude, that's in bag number 347. Okay, bag 347. Okay. Get an aperture. Gotta get it. Okay. to want a rake soil over in the area of the old station 10 also so it's up to you whether 
easier to go get it now or to get the double core now. Let's get through with this one. Let's get the soil, Charlie. We'll get the soil. Okay, well, I think it's easier to go get it, John, because i got to take, to do the double core. Right, I agree. i got to take this thing apart. We That's a good idea, Charlie, and then you won't need the rake anymore.
Are we going to ask them to go back and look at it? What, what is the question there? That's what I'm thinking. I know, I doubt it would be able to see any camera here. I think it's going to be too far. He had about 20 pounds of soil, Tony, and he came up with one little frag. And it, we just dropped it. Totally dropped it. That's enough. Yeah. Yeah, let's just call that out right now. He's got about four frags and 349. Okay, it's 349. Okay. Go ahead, Mike. Okay, uh, then we need a soil sample, John. Discussion whether you want to go back to the uh, water pack or not. Well, can we uh, check that out? This is science. Can we check that out by the TV camera? Second. Can we check that out with the uh, TV camera? Well, we'll give it a try. I kind of doubt you can tell. But, uh, I think that's the only thing that we had in mind. Just let me check. Okay. That's great. Okay, let me get one more scoop for okay? Yeah. Yeah, that's Okay, we're back. Bag uh, 350, we didn't get a number. Okay, we're back. Bag uh, 350, we didn't get a number. Uh, yeah, 350, Tony, it was. Okay. Thank you. 
bags truly. Right here on my camera. That let me have them. Okay, well, here's a couple that are torn off you could use. One. And, uh, it's some of them must be solid. Huh? There you go. Used to this black ball that I've got, uh, didn't have any gift to it. Okay. Going in the bag, uh, 380. Okay, 380. Okay, double course of symbol. Give me the, uh, impact. Well, it's smooth on one side and has impact bits on the other. What do you mean, Charlie? The scoop. I mean, the, uh, right. Pardon me. Okay, and you've got about 17 minutes left here. How are you talking? Is that with the right, John? Yes, sir. Tony, we do with the right? Yeah, we sure are. Okay, here it goes. Ah. Look at that just go. Slight experiment. Okay. A little can is sticking up on top of the CND console. Okay. Uh, warning flag. Hammer, hammer. Uh, we got to make sure that's closed. Before okay, I'll take these two big rocks over. and put them in the big rock bag, Charlie. Okay, that, that, the okay, feeling's got to go in there, too. The parking spot. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'm curious if the warning. Uh, that's a thermal problem. It leaked, that heat into the CND console. No, it looks like it's good at any. Uh, hey, Tony, I'm pushing all in all, almost uh, oh, three great. quarters of the way on the bottom really core. Okay. Well, I'm not going to hear that one, Charlie. John, can you look? Uh, 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 I take a picture of that uh, for me? Camera. Uh, it's uh, really uh, Camera. the one thing we want after that we're okay. Okay. And John, while you're looking around there, our number one priority is a particular result. Yeah, we're near the lamp. Uh, what? You know, but we told them about that, and they said that one's not good. That may be a fire one. Yeah, that You're doing real good there, Charlie. Take the most frustrating job. You never make a living as a carpenter. You want a pressure suit, I'll tell you. Okay. John, how about spinning and taking one more picture of that in the ground? Could you? Hey, well, I'm steady. About half 11 or so. Just half 11. Uh, we can move on back to the left at this point. Hey, Tony, at the bottom of this core, it looks whitish. Check it. Let him go on out the right. And it's pretty coarse grained. Uh, it's not, uh, I do want to look yes. inside of here. Not real fine. It's going like that. Back to the lamp. It's probably normal. Shock rock. Shock rock. There's some sand thing in that crater right behind the lamp. Okay, we're going to do that sampling after closeout. So 
to fill up the last bag or something. That's the idea. I'm trying to you want them to sample before they close out or close out first? Yeah, I think you need to, don't you have to sample before you close out? Maybe, yeah, I want here. to, yeah. Yeah, okay. Now, Houston, I'm looking, but I'm not seeing any machine. Okay, after get this. Now, Houston, I'm looking, but I'm not seeing any machine. Okay, after to get this core packed up. Why don't you drive on back to the LEM, to the normal closeout position, and we'll let you sample around there, see if you can find one around there. You described something in a crater behind the LEM. Uh, 
Johnson, go ahead and do that UV right away, though, shouldn't he? Uh, yeah. Go ahead, do that. You beat me, I'm looking. Out at me. Okay, basalt, where are you? Okay, basalt, where are you? Okay, it's a magic uh, spectacular white rock, uh, it, uh, but it's kind of dust coated. But it is uh, in, in so fine grain that I can't see uh, any crystalline structure associated with it. It's sort of covered with that. You can see plenty of that bit. That's going in bag uh, one, one three. Okay, with that bag one one three. Tony, I just picked up one that uh, is in bag 15 that is, uh, has a black matrix, bluish black matrix with a lap like uh, either clasp or uh, phenocrist in it. And uh, it's right behind the limb here. I don't know whether that's what we're looking for or not. Oh, good. That was good, uh, Charlie. There are a lot of the rocks that I call the six. Uh, there's some of the rocks that I call vesicular basalts around here, but I don't know whether uh, what I really call was correct or not. That might have led y'all astray. Uh, that's okay. Uh, we've got. It might have been just a glass coating on the rock. We've got about 10 more minutes of sampling. Uh, why don't you just uh, pick up what looks interesting to you there, and then we'll start closing out. Okay. John, you bringing the machine down here? Wait. Just leave it. It's three two. That's three two. Yeah, let's just live with that. That's yeah, going down. That's three five, John. It looks good. Okay. It's been twenty minutes adjusting the TV and then turn it off. Going back out to. Right here. Yeah, I'm on dust. Oh, 
Okay, and John, when you're ready, I've got a new UV setting. Okay, we'll reset the UV. And uh, you can continue sampling for about one, five more minutes, and then we'll have to load up. Okay. That's about three sample left, but I'd be down a bag anyway. Okay. Okay, with a new UV setting. Wait a minute. Well, I'll tell you one thing, the character of the regolith has really changed between uh, here in uh, Stone Mountain and uh, I'll give you a okay. reset. Okay, and your azimuth is 275 and the elevation is 66. 275 and 66. Alrighty. Yeah, there's a grab sample in, in 18. Okay, bag 18. Yeah, there's a grab sample in, in 18. Okay, bag 18. Uh, it's partially documented, I should say, not a grab sample. Right, we've got it on TV. The big eyes on ya. The big eyes. Okay. There's a neat rock. There. Doesn't look like a picture. Okay. 275. Okay. And 66. Uh, that's affirmative. Well, I hope this baby works. Okay, Charlie, after this rock, uh, we'd like you to start closing out. Okay. I'll do it. Bag number 19, Tony. Okay, bag 19. And Tony, the last one I pick up is the igneous rock, no pressure. Hey, outstanding. I am not kidding. And it's got lab crystals in it and a black matrix. But it is not, uh, it is not uh, basaltic. Outstanding, Charlie. How's that for timing there, uh, experiments? They're coming in there just right. Well, what's going in bag 19? It's not anymore. I'll come over to help you, Charlie. No, I got it, John. This is in bag number 20, Tony. I'll get bag 20. We got to start. He wants us to close out there, John. Okay. I guess we're through with those samples. <laughs> Gifting this test is just like an abrasive. Anytime you rub something, you can no longer read it. And that's what's happened to our RCUs and our... and our, uh... <laughs> piece of kit we've got. In other words, it's a mistake to rub something to clean it off. I understand. It's a mistake. Okay, uh, we're starting a little bit ahead of, uh, ahead of time with the closeout here, and we'd like you to take your time and make sure we get everything. Sure. So would we. We can bet we're not going to leave anything. Good show. Okay, Tony, the core tubes are going in, uh, in bag number uh, seven. Okay, core tubes in bag seven. Quiet experiments. Go ahead. Yeah, we didn't it's hard to get any rocks in. The reading here, the limb. Of John, you want to hold close mine? The final reading okay. is, uh, includes a bolt reading. That's what we're concerned about. So we'd like to get a bolt reading off the rover. That kind of helps us know uh, at the rest of the
you are yeah. when we talk it uh, finally, right? Yeah, we can get it there too. That'd be good. Okay, that's great. Hold here. I think that's the plan. Place. Don't get me all fucking. I don't want that page. Well, we'll you done. Okay, LRV. We got done. Huh? Okay, Charlie, here you go. Okay, I'm through with it. Put it over there. Put it in there, and I'll throw out the rocks. Wanna, wanna pull my pistol carrier? Better believe it. Harness? That's the day of my life. Okay. Right, we have a clue on George. Yeah, I'm talking about this. We didn't know. No, we didn't have an emergency. Quick release, 10. And uh, that's the one that we couldn't get snapped inside. I might uh, try to keep a hold of a sample bag, so when you go out and park the rover, we may have you pick up a rock and put it on the LPM. Oh, yeah, I forgot all about that. Uh, You want me to? I'll take my uh, camera with me too. Rod. I'll take my uh, camera with me too. Rod. Charlie's camera one. You got, you got any pictures left? Bye. Uh, yeah, you? No. You're out completely? No, no. I want frame 150. I guess I got enough. Oh, you got it, huh? Yeah. You're not going to drive out there yet, are you? No, no. Okay. Put it in my teeth. Wait, did you get the bags, Charlie? Uh, there, I threw them away, John. He said he was through with them. Okay, well, they're, they're, down right to, here. they're down to the left of the limb there. Here's one right over here. That uh, John uses to measure the LPM. They'll leave a sample bag there to bring that rock back. Okay. Okay, just leave it under your seat, okay? Okay. Thank 
Ara is already in the spacecraft. Man, Tony, you don't know how much fun this has been. I think I'll try. Yeah, I think it's been obvious in your voice how much fun it's been. Okay, Charlie, anytime you put anything in the spacecraft, if you could call it off. Uh, okay, I'm I'm putting things in the uh, ETB right now. Okay, could you call it off if you put it in there and we'll keep track or help you? Oh, okay, all the film uh, that we brought out except the two mags, uh, the mag on the deck and the uh, two mags on the camera, Magazine F and Magazine Echo are uh, still on the cameras. John seat bag is empty. A uh, film. Okay, Houston, the cosmic ray experiment plate will not pull out. Oh no. Okay, we copy that. Very neat with strap to pull it out with. Uh, if you hold it upright and shake it, do you think it'll come out the bottom? You want me to do that? I want to try that. Why don't you pull and let me hold the, hold the thing? No? Hey, just John, sir. Let me, let me suggest that. Let me hold it, the frame, and, uh, Pull on it. Hey, just John, sir. Let me let me suggest that. Let me hold it, the frame, and uh, you pull on it. Here we go. Move, did it? Damn it! Got the no string to hold on. How about your pliers? Hey, there you go. Hey, can you reach them? You want me to get them for you? Yeah. Okay, there you go. Get it so I can uh, get the thing open. So I get the first frame out, then we can get it.
Okay. The wind must have played relatively cool. Good job. Okay, yeah, Tony, when I, uh, that thing was hot, I'll tell you, when I uh, uh, had the frame, uh, I could, after five, however many minutes, I could start feeling it through my gloves. Uh, supplies are going to hang you up. You want me to unsnap them? Uh, no, no. Pliers are going to hang you up. You want me to unsnap them? Okay, they're unsnapped. No, they aren't either. You want them unsnapped? I'll just throw it back in there. Okay, give it here. It's the whole work. Wait a minute, wait, wait. Let me throw it up. Let me throw it up. Okay, you got it. Okay, I'm gonna take the bag off. Right, take the bag off. Okay, drop that bag and take the bag. That's the motion. Okay, no more, uh... Okay, Tony, we're not doing any, uh, Grand Prix anymore, are we? Negative. You're clipping badly, Tony. Thank you. Uh, negative. No Grand Prix. Okay, I'm going to retrieve the cosmic ray now. Okay, the oil and rod. Charlie, I just retrieved it. I don't mean the cosmic ray. I mean the SWC. Uh, you understand? Thank you very much. Go ahead. We're standing by for a... Oh, that's why I can train it. Uh, storage bag for the CRD. Okay. Drive the gray detector is bagged. Yeah, and as near as I can tell, there's no thumbprints on it. But any of the plate. Okay. This thing's kind of mine. It's a while, Tony. Go ahead. Play again. What you want? Well, he reads the templates from that story. Look at that, Charlie. Lead across the crater. He goes the javelin throw. Wow. Oh, we need a world record. But... Okay. Okay, Tony, this thing, when it wound up, I, I tried to... It got away from me. It tore just a little bit, but I think we'll be able to get it to bang. Up at the upper part. It lined up like a, a window shade. That's okay, it'll work fine that way. Doesn't make any difference. Okay, I got it wound up. Uh, no, I'll get it later. Okay. In fact, I'll get it right now. Okay, it's, uh, it's all, uh, Oh, okay. I'll be out of that. Flight ABA, I think, uh, LMP is a little ahead on the checklist. Uh, I don't believe he's got drama out of that counter, so. Yeah, I was just going through that. Okay, Charlie, and uh, I verify or uh, remember the drum on the uh, penetrometer. Yep, thank you. Okay. Okay, Charlie, I'll put the big rock bag on the ladder hook. Okay. Actually worked, Tony. Came off. Good job. Did you get the big rock out of the foot pad? Yeah. Get old Mealy out of there. <laughs> Charlie, is this bag here for for to go inside? Uh, 
I didn't put it there. The one that was there from last time. That's it's empty? Yeah, it's a CB2. I'll throw that under the lamp. Okay. This bag is pretty full. We got two full rock box bags and a and one that's partially full, John. Okay. We got uh, four and six are full and seven is got two core tubes and a excuse me. Okay. Man, this shadow's almost gone. Right. Are those core tubes they got anything in them? Yeah. Sure do. Sure. Yeah, you finished, uh, let me get one more picture of you dirty. Okay, okay. Turn around. Wait a second, Charlie. Okay. Now, are you sure you want a record okay, of that? Tony, I've got the uh, magazine from the... The, the, the jacks, the, all the mags. Say again. Uh, the jacks, uh, all the mags. Say again. I just said, go ahead, Charlie. Okay, the only thing we don't have in the ETB that I see is the, uh, is the, uh, CRE, and that's going in right now. Okay. What, uh, Tony, what? Hey, John, you're taking a camera with a magazine out with you? Yes, sir. Okay. Could I have a final count on the magazines they should have in there? Okay, we'll work that up. Okay, Houston, I got one more rock here that I was looking at out of the one because I'm in a module. And I got plenty of pictures of it, so you put it in a big rock bag. Oh, there's ET, it's going at ETB. Yeah. Right there. No, oh, that's big. Foxtrot into the uh, ETB and it's got uh, 130 frames exposed. Okay. Hey, John. Yeah. Take a look. So. Okay, I tell you, you should have. Uh, Uh, Carl, you should have a seven Hasselblad and three uh, DAC magazines. Uh, there actually be six in there right now, one still on John's camera. Hey, stand by. Okay. 
doing a special a special salute to me, from me to the United States Air Force on their silver anniversary this year. The one of the boys in blue is pretty far out right now. You bet you, sir. That's outstanding. Here we got uh, four hours and 15 minutes or so. Okay? So my watch stopped. About that. Hmm. Okay, let's see. Except for, I'll start taking this. As you turn the LRV configure, you're going to do. Let's see. Back, driving. WC, Astro Actions, we got a bypass. Okay, we gotta clean the MUs and stow antennas before you drive off. Okay. I guess. Here's the old dust brush. I tell you what, why don't you park the rover while I make sure everything's under the limb? <clears throat> and uh, we'll dust when we get back, okay? Okay, I'll bring yeah, I'll bring the dust back. Okay, and I'll just take a couple of SCBs and take them in here. I'll bring it. There you oh, you got a new one. I'll see him out there. Oh, so that's right, yeah. Okay, I'm going to park the rover, Houston. I think we got everything out of the drift to get, okay? Okay, it sounds good. We think so, too. They were going to do a bunch of exercises. We had made up in the Lunar Olympics. Show you what a guy could do on the moon with a backpack on. But about oh, uh, 380 pounds, guy, that's pretty good. They, they threw that out. Okay. Is that big Dewey Rock still out there? Yeah, it's got some nice wood straight in the air. I heard it talking about it. About four feet. Okay. Wow. Oh. Darling, that ain't any fun, is it? That ain't very, that ain't very smart. Well. Sorry about that. Right, now we just have some work to do. Uh, uh, like that. I thought I had to try it. If we didn't, it wouldn't do that. Okay. Yeah, I want to park the road. Okay. Like he asked me. We'll start upstairs, yeah. Well, no, you're too dirty to go up there. I'm not going in. I'm just taking some bags up, okay? Okay, do you want the LCR to switch one when we start out there, right, Houston? Yeah, I don't think so. We can talk to him. Yeah, that's fine. Do you read over? Yeah, let me know. That was a good And we're getting a picture. There it is. Oh, we're getting a picture. Right there, you can see a crest there. That's very good. It's really hard to see. Yeah, a little tight there. It's a little screw there. I found a part about half a hard side of it, Arnie. Yeah, it's not some warning spice. Yeah. That would be great. Right. Be great. Okay. I'm going to get a, cro a couple of cross sign stereos, is all. Is that all right? That's fine. Thanks. We've got the location on the way here. Okay. And, uh, John, when you start dusting off the panel, we'd like to oh, yeah. have the caution. No, it's just that you got a thermal heat there. Uh, okay, Tony, it's an igneous rock, not a breccia. Okay, great. And it's got that sugary texture to it. Okay. Dusting. John, why don't I do that and you put the LPM out? Hey, there you go. Okay, here's your rock. Okay, what's it sitting on the seat on? Okay. Camera, too. That's Charlie. You can buy the camera up there. Yeah. 
Okay, Tony, that's the frame count uh, 156 and 57. Okay. 155 and 56 for the, uh, that rock. Okay, we copy that. But sure, we got, we got a bag left, John? Yeah, put a bag under the seat. Oh, good. Here's a pair of switches coming on, Houston. Okay. We'd like to adjust that panel and the top of the console. All right, sir, just a moment. Okay. What panel? Uh, the, uh, the control panel on the LRV. Oh, all right. Why do you want to do that, Houston? You got a dust. Keep the temperature of the panel down, fine. Uh, we want to keep the temperature of the panel down. I guess so. Keep it nice for the next guy. I guess so. Keep it nice for the next guy. Those circuit breakers up there. Okay. Okay, the top of the panel is dusted, Tony. Okay, great. And we'll need the all sides of that uh, console, I guess, that panel you just tested. All right. Okay, the top and the driver's side is dusted. Uh, the left battery is dusted. I'm going to dust a little crew. And Charlie, uh, after dusting the crew there, you'll have to tear off one of those uh, thermal blankets and put it over the uh, control panel on the crew. The 65%. Yeah, big one. The 65% one. So which one? Uh, the 65% blanket. And John, we saw you get back and we start at your clock. Okay, thank you. Let me show you what to do with that one, Charlie. Okay. You want a picture of the, of the, you want a picture of it, don't you? Yeah, that'd be a good idea. I gotta see how it goes. Now, you know, we sure hope you guys have enjoyed watching this as much as we've enjoyed doing it. There's one thing that's a real pleasure, it's just gravity. Okay, and you've got a minute, and uh, we sure enjoyed watching, I can tell you. Well, I hope we got all the rocks, Tony, that are here. We got all the rock types that look different from any other rock type. John, is that right on the uh, thermal blanket? It covers the thing. That's pretty good. Huh? No, it's both there, and uh, let me show you. Oh, I see. Don't let it attach it to down there. Yeah. Ah, oh, you got it. Yep. Super. They got one more battery to go. Oh. And, John, you want to get that and don't walk uh, towards the LPM there, Charlie? Oh. And, John, you want to get that and don't walk uh, towards the LPM there, Charlie? Right.
15 marks out of 10. That's 25 foot deep. Clear? Go ahead, please. Okay, Houston. Three one seven five two five. Five three one seven five two five five one three. Three two zero five two six five one three. Three two one five two six. Five one three. Okay, we copy those. Okay, we copy those. Okay, if you'll bag that with an uh we've got it here, you can go on in. The U V camera. Yeah. Hey, what do you want me to do with L P M? Wanna get it out of the way so it doesn't flap around and hit the crew and lift off or something? Uh, we're not too worried about it. Just leave it there. Yeah. Alrighty. Flight, can we have the bag number for the rock? Okay. We need a bag number for that rock. And John, uh, when you bag that, when you bag number. against the time limit, we'd like you to get on in. That's yeah, not a foot time I had uh, wait ready to get dusted and get my antenna. There again? Uh, that's not a foot time limit, that's uh, for getting on or work. getting ready for liftoff. Yep. Yeah, I understand. And Charlie, I hope you're working over your thing. Yeah, uh, I don't remember. <laughs> Boy, Houston, the beauty of this place is just absolutely incredible. We agree. There's another spectacular view. The pilot who missed the crater. Watch out. Watch out, John. Okay. Yeah. To your left is that crater. It must be, be pretty good to uh, visit on landing and fall in and fall in off before taking off, huh? Well, the way I've been falling, I probably would. That's why I steered way clear. Boy, this backpack, once you get it torqued off, you, you, can't, you can't stop it. Not without moving. That's right. Fast. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'll put the rock. If you take your camera off, I'll put the uh, rock in, the, in this SCB over here. Okay. Okay. Did you give him the bag number? Okay. Did you give him the bag number? Yeah. Okay, uh, Houston, I'm up to frame count 168 on magazine E. Okay. Okay, John. Ready to be tested. Boy, that's the last one. It's not going to come out because, uh, yeah, you know, I take it off. <laughs> you got to take it off. 
It dropped 169 of those over sitting there. Boy, that's a good machine. That's an incredibly good machine.
do that engine bay, we didn't even blow out that big old rock over there. Do that engine bay, we didn't even blow out that big old rock over there. Well, here you go. Flip size anyway. Okay, uh, fellas, uh, we should be pressurized in about uh, five minutes. Oh, that's great. Boy, is that very empty. Can you, uh, uh, yeah. All right, all right, knee on your antenna. Okay, okay, stay around this one. Roll. Can we get in? No, you're great. Right, right. Yeah. Okay, that's the best I can do, John. Boy, that's about it, Charlie. That's about the best we can do. Okay, let me bend over and I get your antenna. I'm in an operation here. And Houston, this portable life support system is really a good piece of gear. Okay. Okay, it's down here. Are you reading us over? Yeah, we are. Are you copying us? I think it's reading us. It sounds like it does. Houston, are you reading us over? Uh, we copy you five by. How us? I want to get in. Why don't you go ahead and get in? Get my, you want to get that antenna? Your antenna? Yeah. Uh, no, we don't need so it anymore. Okay. 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 Check with that we're just a, We're checking the flight. Okay. I don't know what happened to the car. <laughs> Hello, Orion. This is Houston. Hello, Orion. This is Houston. Hi there, we lost you for a while. Yeah, we sure did. Now we're getting kind of back on the timeline. We'd like to hustle you on in there. With a UV. There's Charlie climbing through the door right now, Houston. Okay, and you've got the UV to get yet? That's right. Okay. What happened to the comm, Tony? I think we had a dropout down here. Okay. Okay, Houston, Okay, Tony, I'm inside. Good show. Put two rock bags. The uh, jet counter is a uh, track light -like test listed there. I think we'll fork over there. Skip. Okay, and uh, we'll skip the track light -like test and just let you uh, get on in. It works. I can't install it during the... Uh, yeah, we already tested it once. Okay, fine. Let's uh, let's not do it now. Oh, I'm sorry, John, but I brought some dirt in with me. <laughs> Okay, Charlie, I'm going to bring up the, uh, Houston, I'm going to reset the YUV camera. Okay, reset three times. And re remove the mag. Okay, and come off. Two, three, okay, then, uh, camera's coming off. And, uh, like, um, Dennis Brewer. Go ahead, Tony. Do the LMP. Because that is. Tone here. He recommended don't Being removed. Needed. Okay. It's out. Uh, there it go. And, uh, Step out. Like. It and the, uh, 
getting uh, bank six. We're going to go up the ladder this time again. Okay, and uh, Charlie, you're you're going to get a feed water uh, flag pretty soon. Uh, just leave it. Uh, don't put on the auxiliary. Okay, we copy that. Makes the ETD stay closed. Huh? Just take it up, bro. Put the big rock bag? Yeah. It won't, there's no, there's some snaps on it, but we can, don't worry about that. We'll get that later if you can bring it up open. Okay, I'm uh, disconnecting the uh, LEC and dropping it under the... Yep. Wait two seconds, let me get behind the hatch and... I got it. Okay. That's a big rock right there. Okay. Charlie's get behind the hatch, Houston. Okay. So I can get in that baby. Okay, I'm back as far as I can get, John. Okay, let me get my visor up here. Do what I'm doing. Okay, 
Okay, it's closed and locked, Charlie. Okay? Great. Right, you can scooch over just to the right just a little bit. Let me get this stuff out. Okay, we're in auto. Okay. Experiments flight. Auto. That's the hip on it. Hey, just hit it. Auto. Okay. It is. Very quick. 16 ECF. Get ready to go. Here we come. Got three. Coming up. Right. Pressure's coming up. Okay. 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 Ryan, uh, this is Houston on that uh, rendezvous radar position. Uh, we saw a plus 3-3 three, three instead of 3-3-3. Three, three, three. Zero, zero, over. There's no problem, flight. Did I miss the call? What was it? No, he, went, he just uh, lost one number in his... Uh, We were happy with that uh, reposition. I missed the call, Jim. Okay, Dick, are you hey, having Jim, a uh, yeah, uh, uh, I put the thing up through the optics all the way uh, uh, to it looking at me. Is that all right? That's good, Clyde. Okay. Okay, it's fine, Charlie. Thank you. Expect a little noise there since we're relaying until we lock up the CSM to okay. play away. Thank you. 
Gilbert's on time. Roger, we saw lift off. What a, what a ride, what a ride.